Trevor stealing a cold trend to third in the Classics and you've been having such a great weekend and you did more damage on the final little jump in the whole event than the rest of the weekend. Yeah, we just thought we'd try and beat Clay in the last stage and we just did, but we took out the post right at the finish. <laughs> Cole, um, tough event for everybody, particularly these older cars. They cop a punishment, don't they? They certainly do. Um, this is a, they're, they're pretty old now and uh, it's a real struggle to get them to the finish in uh, one piece, but this uh, old girl's held together pretty well and uh, we've got here uh, and finished in third place. It's a pretty good effort, yeah. Trevor, big effort to come across the Nullarbor to the West for one event. We really appreciate you making it worthwhile for you now. Oh, absolutely. I said to Cole beginning of the year, can you do rally camp? And he said, no. Can you do Queensland? He said, no. I said, we better go for Perth for a joke. And he said, yep, so we made it happen. Making it a Toyota Celica 1-2 in the Classics. Clay, bad knocking Andrew Dunbar. Well done, mate. Trouble free run, you told me. Yeah, we did. The car ran uh, flawlessly all weekend, as it should. And, um, and we, we started off steady and worked our way up and got some confidence. And, and we're here at the end. And... We had a lot of fun. First time here to the Perth Roads here, Andrew. What's it like calling the notes from uh, from that side in these such loose conditions that's caught a lot of people out? Yeah, it was. Uh, I guess the roads are, uh, are pretty loose, and um, you know a lot different to what we're used to. But uh, it was a bit like the cars on rails with clay driving, so it wasn't too bad. But don't get to look up very often. We're going too fast, so <laughs> <laughs> that's always a good sign if they're not looking clay. And you had a lot of people give you a lot of advice about this. What was your take on this rally? Yeah, everyone, everyone said stay in the line. Well, there was no line. <laughs> we got the first stage looking for it. Um, because all the cars ahead of us are four-wheel drive and front-wheel drive, there's not a line for me uh, or Neil. Um, so we just had to keep it clean and tidy. And, and as I said, we started off slow and kept it clean and tidy and then just kept building on it. And, and in the end, I don't think it was as bad as what I thought it would be and, and I ended up quite enjoying it. Classic winners in the very spectacular Toyota Celica, Neil Bates, Coral Taylor, well done. Tough weekend for all the classics in the Good Forest Rally, isn't it? Yeah, look, Western Australia is some of the toughest roads in Australia, so, you know, it's uh, a very, very tough rally, and, you know, for, uh, obviously, for 30-year-old cars, it's even tougher, but, um, look, the leak is incredibly strong and reliable, and, yeah, it was faultless all weekend. As usual. Now, Cole, you had several roles this weekend. No, he's obviously steering this guy around in the notes, but you've had your brain all over the place, of course, following Molly. How, how was that? This is actually a tough gig to be a, a mum and a co-driver and all that sort of stuff. Yep, particularly in the same rally when it's this tricky. And, and it says, danger, left three, narrow exit. <laughs> and my immediate thought is... I hope Molly's got that one in her notes. <laughs> I thought that so many times. <laughs> so, so you were getting extra double cautions from yours. I think How, timing was still okay through those ones. Oh, I don't look, know. I actually said on the way out, the you know, Coral did a perfect job in the stages. She was very busy looking to find see how Molly was going to the transports, but uh, didn't know where we're going, so it was all good. And she did tell me. <laughs> yeah, but I'm no. just amazed how many things I realised this rally. How many things you can actually think of when you're co-driving and you think you're really busy calling notes but when something like the molly thing's happening I had lots of time to think about approaches to downhill slippery corners and all sorts of things it was amazing. So you're being a driver and a co-driver? Yeah what I had to do is just make it nice and smooth so nothing seemed too dangerous and she didn't worry. <laughs> yeah that's why the results come. Congratulations though true professionals and classic winners well done. Thank you.